Today was Kira DeWoolett's fifth day as Avonworth High School's principal. She called a school-wide assembly no principal ever wants to lead. It's your worst nightmare to have to address a student body and, and teachers and, and give them a plan to get through a day like today. Hannah Milbert was, by all accounts, a leader, whether on the soccer field or in the classroom, in her Girl Scout troops or in the community. She was a 15-year-old who gave a lot of herself. And there was a lot of pain, a lot of broken hearts, um, but we, we made it through today and we'll make it through tomorrow and, and we'll keep honoring her. Grief counselors were available for students coping with the loss. Nicole Levis says the administration had a plan to help teenagers deal with a friend gone too soon. We've had numerous kids uh, in the building that have needed support. Um, some of them because they were connected to Hannah, some of them because the death just um, sparked a, an emotion that they weren't expecting. We spoke with the assistant fire chief in Ohio Township today. The house was fully involved when they arrived, the structure collapsing in just minutes. Dealing with bitter cold on a home at the end of a private drive, they were unable to make any efforts to get Hannah Milbert out. Her Girl Scout leader told us yesterday that her loss will be felt deeply by a lot of people. She has packed boxes for the poor. She has fed the needy. Um, she is so philanthropic, so full of life. She has so many friends. A GoFundMe page was set up to help with the Milbert family. It's raised $75,000 in the 48 hours since the fire. We're live in Ohio Township tonight. David Kaplan, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.